I am very excited to see the bracket. I want to know exactly which teams are going against which teams. I want to know our next match. I want to, like I said a couple episodes ago, I want the whole layout of every volleyball match playing. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with High Q to the top or season four, episode 12 called Vivid. Last episode, we had um, our boys beat Tsubaki Hara in two sets. Fantastic match, fantastic plays, fantastic feeling for us getting warmed up and going through some of the some of the ordeals of our first match but we're definitely getting there and i'm very excited very good seeing the neighborhood association back the old third years from karasuno back all around lots of love lots of positivity in this gym so i am here for it i am excited i'm not gonna waste any time because that's exactly where it ended and we're gonna continue in this episode Remember, if you guys want early access and full length to this show and all the other shows I'm watching, like Jujutsu Kaisen, Black Clover, many, many more to come in the future, we are four episodes ahead over there. There is full length, all that jazz. Links are always in the description for you guys. If you guys want to support me, and Patreon's not really your thing, if you guys could just leave a like and a nice comment, it really does help me with that YouTube algorithm. Don't forget to subscribe if you guys currently are not subscribed. Click that bell so you guys always know exactly when I post. And then don't forget to follow me on all my social medias, Instagram, Twitch, and Twitter, at Dapper Darius. Thank you guys so much. High Q, season four, or to the top, episode 12, Vivid. Let's do this. Bokuto, okay, it's exactly what I wanted to see. Some more matches. Kohei, so they're down by two. I see. Oh, he's in a slump, uh-oh. Akashi, you gotta get him out of that. You gotta get him out of that. Let's get him over here. He's in like the side arena. Weakness number six. He wants to stand out. I get him. Sub arena. Damn. I, it's way bigger over there. I get it. I understand. <laughs> Good to see you guys. Our senpai is senpai. It's a great way of putting it. Oh, so third, old third year, second year, one year younger. Got him. So real quick, don't want to pause it. That's why it makes sense why Yamaguchi and Hinata wouldn't know Kurokawa. But uh, uh, Tanaka, Nishinoya, all of them would know him. It was like, oh, cool, Carl, it's so good to see you. Because he was the third year when they were second years, and Tanaka and Nishinoya were first years, whereas they wouldn't know uh, Tashiro, because he was the third year when Daichi and Sugawara were first years. This is just for my pro I know you guys know. This is just for me. I'm sorry. I just need to be able to process that. <laughs> That's what I say. I say we're not the underdogs. We're the unknown dogs. I've been saying that so much. I love it. Oh. You are the senpai. Sumimasa. Hey, it was great seeing you guys, though. Thanks for coming. Kenma, Kuro. I love seeing all my boys. Oh, my God. Ooh. Oh, beautiful. Hell, yeah. And that's, what is it, one-to-one? -one? No, that's two. That's two. Well, they won. Hell, yeah. That's what, exactly what I wanted in this Nationals, the updates from all the teams. Shows the coaches talking to coaches, managers working on getting stuff ready for the next match. Shopping with the squad? That's literally my face. Oh, just like Bokuto, the way the ace is such a fire shirt. Oh my god, that was a beautiful set. Oh my god. True, when you think about how it's sectioned off, yeah. So everyone in this whole arena is watching you. Look at Akashi being uh, plug, being amazing. They're watching you and 
Your student. Oh, uh, with the way of the ace. This is perfect. Akashi is amazing. With the exact shirt, this is perfect. He's back. Look at that. He's back. I don't think anybody does. If anyone know, it would be you. Here he comes. We didn't even hear him say a word after that speech. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at this man. <laughs> Look at this man jump. <laughs> that man is a gangster, bro. What a beautiful line shot. <laughs> I love this music when it plays too. Hey, hey, hey! It's my boy. I can totally see why people love Bokuto immensely. Bro, when he does his crosses and he's fucking. He has a shoulder of, of gods. Look at him being humble. It's my boy, Akashi. Definitely is. I can also attest to that. Very much so. I didn't even realize that was dub. Let's go. Fuku Radani, Nekoma, we passed. I recognize that voice. Oh, yes. Oh, someone told me he voice acted another voice or something like that. No, I don't know. Maybe it wasn't Hoshiyumi, but... Little giant versus little giant. This is what I've been waiting to see for so long. He said, can I get a small on that? I wonder if he's getting the same shirt. Oh, I want to know so much more about him. His hair color works perfectly with his school's color. Wait, no, they don't know each other. They've never met. But you can feel it. The pressure. <laughs> the rivalries with everything. If I look away, I lose. Yep. This is the connective tissue. How casual it is. Oh, we won. Thanks. How'd it go? Good. Hinata's even shorter. Barely. Middle blocker. Boy, what's up? What's up? Yeah. 164. Nah, he's lying. He's 164. <laughs> Alright. I wanna know. Ooh, look at him. He looks dope. New rivalry has been added. It's like a fucking achievement on Xbox. People who laughs in the face of Grit will be made to cry by Grit. I like that t-shirt. Bro, there's so many amazing players here. I would need exactly that book. I would need that exact book. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. I could see him hating interviews, that's funny. He's getting inspired. Ooh, I love that. Oh my god. Get that floor seat. You know Observant Hinato definitely wants to read and study him so much more. I love this. The dinks, the blocks, the feints, the crosses, everything. This man is all around incredible. Don't tell me it fucking serves too. Don't tell me this man is the goat. Oh my god. What is this man? What is this man? <laughs> what is this man? Oh, bro, did it, for he not to hear that being called to someone else on this national stage, which is where he got his original little giant inspiration. I can't not agree though. Right? He's never faltered against... That's actually a great point. Wow! Actually, I never thought about it like that. How Hoshiomi would be easily the most intimidating player he not just ever seen. He's seen against people who are naturally gifted in terms of height, stuff that he has... He doesn't have accessible to him. But to see someone who's almost equivalent to him in, in physical stature just excel in every possible way beyond Hinata would be very shocking to him. Thank you, Sugawara, for the very good observation. I didn't even think about that. For Nationals, that is a demolish score. 25 to 18. Oh my god. 
You did all this good stuff even though you're so tiny. That's a great rebuttal in my opinion. Ooh, so that's why he's been so... Oh, that's another bar, man. Definitely not. Oh, I call him Birdman since the jump, man, but he really is like a seagull. That was a smooth-ass transition, too. And then it's just gonna show the crow. <laughs> White and black feathers, bro. <laughs> I can't wait to see them go against each other. I really cannot. Like, I think I'm looking forward to them more than a Shiro Torizawa, and that says so much. Oh my god, it says so much. He's either got a new wave of inspiration, yeah, something. As this is, uh, uh, this is eye opening for him. That's my boy Hinata. Look at Kageyama. Oh, my boy, some country bumpkin crows. My main man Kuro. Yamamoto, Tanaka, Kenma, Hinata. Oh, I love these squads, bro. I'll see you tomorrow, boys. Right back at ya. Tournament, 40 teams disappeared. Oh my god, don't just put it into perspective like that. That's crazy. We're at nationals though, I'm so hyped. Man, so I sure do hope this was the end of our time playing. I really like this episode being about the other matches, what's going on with them, seeing the other teams, getting updates on there, you know, seeing, going around this whole nationals. Cause it's definitely not just playing. You have to eat, you have to stay overnight. You can go shopping. There's plenty of downtime between games. You can study, you can use it analyzing. You can get rest like uh, like uh, Tsukushima was. You can do whatever, you know, like it's really up to, I love how realistic this is. You know, I've never been to it. I've actually, my high school in a, in basketball. I don't know why it took me so long to think about that, but we won state, we went to nationals. We didn't obviously win. I didn't go to the nationals game because I wasn't so into like my school sports back then, but I did end up going to our state game and that we won that. That was, that was really enjoyable. That was a fun time. Um, I would just, it would be so fun being a school, you know, representing your boys in a place like this where it's so professional, so high quality, and you just get to see them perform at the highest level in this whole like nation. It's just, it's just an all around, just amazing experience. I'm thoroughly enjoying it. I wrote down Tashiro and Kurokawa, the third years and the second year previous our karasuno boys or whatever my, our, our old karasuno boys um so glad they came back i hope they come back for the future you know they got to see an update and as to where we went when they left you know sugawara asahi daichi just being amazing as always tanaka with the girl tanaka's about to get some you know tanaka's the goat so i'm not surprised you know i, I need to know her name as well because like i said people you guys told me she's the uh, ushijima of the girl's side which i cannot wait to see her in action Cannot wait to see Tanaka pop off more. Man, I just want to see everyone pop off more. The Hoshiyumi part of this episode was amazing. I absolutely loved what... Uh, I think I, I just have to assume that's his captain. What he said about him. How he said... Um, he hates when he says you won even though you're so short. But he hates even more hearing you lost because you're so short. So he's because of that dynamic, he's worked so hard and done so much extra work to, to make sure he not only excels in his own division, which is like Hinata's height class, you know, but he excels against anyone and everyone. So he says, I'm amazing because I'm amazing. It has nothing to do with my height, you know, and like... I just I, I think that's a bar and that's literally inspirational for in, in real real life, you know, like whether it be anything, you know, like anything that you consider a disadvantage that you're trying to work on overcoming, you know, you could use that, you know, it's like, damn, I just I, I love the show when it comes to things like that, you know, this plays a, even if high, uh, even though volleyball is a very physical sport, they're, they're, they show a lot of the mental fortitude that goes into playing this and a lot of the resolve and the willpower shouts out to Rob RTTV. 
I'm just saying. Fantastic show. Loving it all around. Thank you guys for enjoying. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. If you guys want early access, full length to this show and all the other shows, you don't want to wait for my next upload bunch, check out the Patreon. Links are down below. I'll see you guys later. Peace out, Apple Squad.